here is the finished product, one magnificent carnivore bread loaf. Let's just go ahead and give it a little bit of a taste test. I've already got a slice right over here with my creamy high fat scrambled eggs, so buttons up. Mm, I could easily eat this every single day. Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in and welcome back to another episode of Carnivore Kitchen. Steven here with TV Fork and today I'm going to be showing you how to make yet again another bread loaf. And for this recipe all we're going to need is some cooked turkey and some whole eggs. And now that we know that we need, what are the steps? Well, step number one, we want to go ahead and cook our turkey. Step number two, let's go ahead and preheat the oven to 400 degrees. I've already done that. Step number three, we want to combine the cooked turkey with the eggs and we're going to go ahead and blend it all up. And now that everything is blended up, the next step we're going to go ahead and add the batter to the loaf pan. The loaf pan that I'm using is roughly four and a half by eight and a half by four and a half. And in terms of the amount of eggs, I'm going to be using 10 eggs for this recipe, 10 whole eggs, and also 500 grams of cooked turkey. The reason I'm doing that is because it's a 50-50 mix. So the whole eggs came out to 500 grams and the turkey 500 grams as well. But let's go ahead and add it to our loaf pan. And this is an optional step, but I like to add parchment paper to the loaf pan just to make cleanup a little bit easier. That way it just makes my life a little bit easier. But if you want to bypass that step, you can do uh, just a regular loaf pan and use some butter to actually spray it as well. But for me, I like doing it this way. And now the last step, we're going to go ahead and place our loaf pan in the oven and we are going to bake it for 60 minutes. The reason that this one is 60 minutes is because I've made this one before and for some reason this one just takes a little bit longer. But we're going to go ahead, set our timer for 60 minutes and once it's done we're going to go ahead and let it cool off, slice it up and give it a little bit of a taste test. And it's been 60 minutes so let's go ahead and take our carnivore bread loaf out of the oven. We're going to let it cool off just a little bit and then we're going to go ahead and give it a taste test. And here is the finished product, one magnificent carnivore bread loaf. Let's just go ahead and give it a little bit of a taste test. I've already got a slice right over here with my creamy high fat scrambled eggs. So, buttons up. Mm, I could easily eat this every single day. And there you have it, one glorious carnivore bread loaf. Go ahead and give it a try and drop your comments down in the comment section and let me know what you guys thought of this recipe. And if you guys have any other suggestions, go ahead and drop your suggestions down in the comment section so I can make whatever you guys want me to make. But that's pretty much it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to smash that like button so I know to keep making these recipe videos in the future. And if you're either new to the channel or haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell as I will be uploading new videos every single day. That's it for today's video. Thanks for tuning in and I will see you again tomorrow.